Google just shocked the entire world with Gemini 1.5. Sundar Pichai and Demis Hassabis recently released a blog post just a couple of hours back which launches Gemini 1.5. I never thought that I would say this thing but I think this is truly the leap forward in large language models. It is better than anything that I've seen at least from the technical report itself. We'll wait for the model for us to check the model but this is amazing. The reason why it is amazing is exactly what I'm going to cover in this video. First of all, this model is going to be available in production. See, anytime you see a large language model getting released, it's very easy to put the model on dress release. But having the ability to run the model in production itself is a huge engineering challenge. And that's why we never know what OpenAI has been doing beneath. And Google is promising that this Gemini 1.5 Pro is going to be available for everybody to use, which is unbelievable engineering feat. Now, what is this Gemini 1.5? Gemini 1.5 is a mixture of experts. I mean, literally, yeah, mixture of expert is everywhere. It's a mixture of expert architecture model. And this model can serve up till 1 million token context window. It's not a joke, like until now, whatever we have seen in the industry is 32K, 128K, 200K. But Google is promising that Gemini 1.5 Pro, it's not even Gemini 1.5 Ultra, it's Gemini 1.5 Pro, Pro will have up to 1 million token. So this 1 million token is not going to be available within the web interface immediately. It is going to be available only for a certain amount of users who get you get past the waiting list but ultimately this will come to the web interface as well but now the main thing is hey you have got 1 million token i mean anybody can promise x amount of token but what if it is completely useless and for that exact reason there is a test that google did or at least uh, like everybody have started doing something that is called needle in the haystack this is an analysis that was done by another fellow youtuber greg i'll uh, link greg's channel in the youtube description you should definitely check it out this is a very popular analysis that was done by greg and what google has done is google has taken the same thing and then done it for google gemini 1.5 pro and what they're saying is completely unbelievable, at least from the sight of it. They're saying that Google Gemini 1.5 Pro achieves near perfect needle recall. That is up to 99.7% for 1 million tokens. That means if you give 1 million tokens inside Google Gemini Pro, Google Gemini Pro will return 99.7% of the token without making any mistake. This is an unbelievable claim. Further, it is upping the unbelievable claim by saying it's not only for text, it is for text, video and audio. I mean, can you even believe it? That Google Gemini is saying or Google is saying that up till 1 million token, you will get up 99.7% recall, which is like you give 9 million tokens uh, sorry 1 million tokens and then you can retrieve 99.7 percent and it says that it even maintains this recall performance when extending up to 10 million tokens in text modality approximately 7 million words 2 million tokens in audio modality up to 22 hours 2.8 million tokens in the video modality up to 3 hours this is this is completely unbelievable this is I definitely want to check out this model. I'm definitely looking forward to check out this model, but this is absolutely insane and crazy. So now Google is saying that it is built on top of their own research, at least like finally Google have started acknowledging that transformers came from them and also their own MOE architecture, mixture of experts. If you're not familiar, Google had actually released a lot of mixture of experts paper before even mixture of experts became popular. Google is saying, okay, we are building it on top of MOE. Uh, we have got greater context up till 1 million token and that does a pretty good job. And they've shown you some demos. Uh, I'm going to take this demo with a pinch of salt, but this time what they've done is they've put the entire screencast, which I'm going to show you quickly. So you can see that they have collected all the information, put it inside the Google AI studio, and then it extracts just like Google promise. And it explains for three different modalities, text, audio and video even for a silent movie it manages to do a good job and google has also said that google gemini 1.5 pro has got an impressive impressive in context learning skill what does it mean during the chat with the chatbot uh, the in context is what you give within the context 
in one given context if it is like 1 million token what is the amount of thing that the model can learn and then give you back this is very important for like things like chain of thought because that is where the model learns something whenever you want to exceed that that is where people go to fine tuning people go to knowledge injection so now what google is saying is that with gemini 1.5 pro with its impressive in context learning which they have tried by doing something called mtob machine translation from one book so you give one book to that chatbot or llm whatever you have got and then you expect the chatbot or llm to learn from that book and then do a machine translation and what google is saying is that when they gave a grammar manual of a language called kalamang a language with fewer than 200 speakers worldwide the llm learned to translate english to kalamang at a similar level to a person learning from the same content this is once again an insane claim so if you have got a language and if you do not have a lot of speakers like in this case 200 speakers you don't have a lot of artifacts about this language but what google is saying is that you can give a grammar manual to this llm that they have built which is gemini 1.5 pro and it can learn it instantly within a prompt nothing no fine tuning no rag we are talking about it is like within a prompt in context learning you can learn it i mean that is that is an extensive amazing claim so where can you use it starting today google is going to offer a limited preview of 1.5 pro to the developers and also enterprise customers via ai studio which if you have not signed up you should definitely go sign up so it would look something like this you can go sign up to google ai studio where you can start using certain models right now this model is still not available i could not see the model maybe when the model is available you can start using it so go sign up yourself for google ai studio and also vertex ai is their cloud platform where you can use this model as a developer and the other thing is uh, they are going to launch 1.5 pro with the standard 128000 token window but they are also going to give a very small set of people like early testers with 1 1 million token context window uh, right now during no cost but i think later on they'll have a different pricing tier is this agi um, i don't know honestly i don't know the answer to this thing because you have got an llm that can read the manual of a language which is like spoken around like 200 people on planet earth and the model can respond back to you with the language it can do translation which is completely unbelievable at this point a lot of things that are mentioned in this is incredible technical advancement and if it has been on production then it is incredible engineering feat but either way i am so excited that this model exists i think this pushes the entire ai llm space completely leap forward i'm looking forward to use google gemini 1.5 and this is a great news for the entire llm industry now it's your move sam altman let's see what is going to happen